Mark, thank you. Our team coverage continues right now. No doubt about it, today was a scorcher, a sizzler. And plenty were searching for ways to cool down. Channel 3 New Haven Bird Chief Matt McFarland found one. He's live at the beach at Lighthouse Point Park in New Haven. Matt? Well, Dennis, here in the Elm City, there are a number of ways to cool down. Of course, you have the splash pads, you have the cooling centers, and then, of course, there's the beach. A quick dip does the trick, especially when the heat index or just how hot it feels inches towards triple digits. Just stay cool, get on the water, be refreshed, and uh, just uh, have a day, good day with the family. Seeing the hot and humid forecast, Carlos Ferrer and his family decided to head down to New Haven's Lighthouse Point Park from their Newington home. Living in New England, we like the hot when it's hot and we like the cold when it's cold because we hot all day, it's not too good but we enjoy it. While for many, it's the sand and the surf. I enjoy the warm weather. I do not like the cold or the snow, so yeah. This is all right. This is all right for me. For little Sophia Maturo, nothing beats running through the splash pad. The water is really cool today. It's really nice. To help folks cope with the hot weather, New Haven's 11 splash pads turn on at 9 each morning and can be used until 8 at night. And for those looking to cool down while staying dry, New Haven activated four cooling centers at the Hall of Records downtown on Orange Street and at three library branches. Fairhaven, Mitchell, and Wilson. Thank God these people had this available for me to come here and sit for a couple hours because I literally was dying out there. Inside the Wilson Branch Library in New Haven's Hill neighborhood, chairs are spaced out for social distancing and masks are a must. Measures in place while folks keep cool during a pandemic. People can come get a bottle of water, use the restroom. We have a couple of patrons now are just charging their phones and just you know, getting out of the heat and staying cool. Which is exactly what Kyle Petrokansky did this afternoon. My suggestion would be keep yourself hydrated. Please get into a cooling center if you can. And, you know, I mean, stay inside. I mean, this, this, this is brutal. And with the hot weather, always an important reminder from the fire department. They say don't open up a hydrant to cool down. It can impact water pressure. And if they have to respond to a fire in that area, instead, they say take advantage of those splash pads. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in New Haven. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.